So today I'm going to show you how to get your amaryllis to grow a seed pod. Uh, obviously, to get any flower uh, to grow a seed pod, the flower needs to be pollinated. And in the case of amaryllis, because it is indoors with no pollinators around, you will have to do this manually. And so right now I have a Minerva amaryllis that is still in bloom with a lot of my other amaryllis flowers mostly spent. So I will use this flower just to kind of demonstrate how I do it. So the flower has the male and the female parts. So you essentially what you need to do is you need to transfer the pollen and I will show you here from the stamen into a pistil. And the pistil is ready to be pollinated as soon as you see this three-pronged shape here, uh, take shape. So, so what I do is how I, I do it is I essentially just break off one of them and then I just swipe the pollen over or swipe the salmon over the pistol and that's pretty much it. That's how I do it. So if you've done this successfully, um, you will see one of these guys forming. This is a seed pod. And even, even if you haven't pollinated the flower, what you will see is as the actual flower uh, matures, this area here is actually going to thicken up. So that doesn't necessarily mean that the flower is pollinated. Um, it's just, it naturally gets a little bit thicker. Uh, but if it's not pollinated, it will kind of, uh, as you see here, it will dry up. Versus this one here, you can see this one's definitely pollinated. And this one here, also uh, pollinated. They look, they look quite actually they look about the same they seem to have three little um, compartments three different compartments here um, this one needs to age a bit but essentially has the same thing uh, this one is much smaller but it's holding up this one did thicken up but it doesn't look like it actually was pollinated so it's probably gonna just dry up and fall off so yeah there's not much to it so here you kind of see the same thing where it got it got a little bit and then the knob got at the base of the flower it did get a little bit thick uh, but it doesn't look like anything's going to be happening here versus you definitely see when the pollination has been successful you definitely see what you know, the outcome is. So that's it. So as the seed pod is maturing, it will eventually um, dry up and crack open. And what that happens, it is time to collect your seeds.